I'm Mike Wrights from the Freedom Foundation, and uh, we have two lawsuits here that we're currently working on uh, through the Constitutional Law Center. One is an appeal of a case that we've been working on for a few months. Uh, we sued Governor Gregor's office a few months ago over her use of the doctrine of executive privilege for withholding records from the public. Executive privilege is not found in our statute. It's not found explicitly in the Constitution. And we thought that that was a problem. So we sued over this issue and, and brought the lawsuit against Gregoire. Unfortunately, we lost at trial. Uh, the judge ruled that Governor Gregoire did enjoy executive privilege and that uh, her office could assert it and then basically put the burden on the requester to show why the information should be released. So we're appealing that ruling. Uh, it's, a, it's an important issue to address. Uh, for 40 years we've had the public records law. For 120 years the state's been, has enjoyed statehood. And there's never been an appellate case ever in state history that says the governor enjoys executive privilege. Not only did the judge say that executive privilege exists, but she also said that if the governor asserts it, we'll automatically treat those records as being privileged. And so for that reason, the Freedom Foundation is appealing that case. We'll be taking it to the state Supreme Court and uh, hopefully making a successful argument there. The other case that we're involved with, and, and it'll be more so down the road, is uh, over this issue of a two-thirds vote requirement for tax increases. Voters of Washington have said numerous times that it requires a two-thirds majority in both houses of the legislature, which is hard to get, which makes tax increases hard to pass, uh, which is why voters keep on voting that into place over and over and over again. The Supreme Court has actually reviewed this two-thirds requirement on three different occasions. There, there have been numerous challenges against it and the court has never voted, or has never held that two-thirds requirements for tax increases are unconstitutional. The Freedom Foundation has filed amicus briefs, which are friend of the court briefs, to help the court with, our, with the analysis of the legal issues. And we'll be doing that again with this, this newest challenge to the two-thirds requirement. We think it's constitutional, it's popularly approved by voters on numerous occasions, and it's survived legal challenges on a number of different in a number of different cases. And so we'll be working on that to defend the rights of taxpayers to say to their legislators, enough is enough, figure out how to spend money within your own means. Whether it's uh, litigating over the role of the executive branch and the power that the governor holds, or litigating over proper restrictions on legislative power and the ability to impose taxes, those all fit within our mission. And so the litigation over those things through the Constitutional Law Center uh, directly serves the mission of the Freedom Foundation.